Well, they got the gate up here on the uh, front of the carousel here. So don't know what they're doing, but they're doing something over here because it's all blocked off. This looks really blue now. Did they paint it or? Yeah, they didn't paint it. It's, it's new. Yeah. Another thing, I was just informed that they closed at six o'clock. Because of the storms. Yeah. So they told us they closed at seven. It's supposed to close at eight today, right? Originally. And they they are closing early because we got storms coming this way around three or five. So it's another reason we're here to catch some storms, maybe. But no, nah, I'm just here to check out what's going on. Separated parties are now meeting at Lost Parents, located at the front gate. Once again, Lost or separated... Got landscaping going in. Alright, we just got off Condor, and I'm going to go on Superman because there is no line. It's to the station. So, why not? And when I mean no line, I mean literally no line. It's at the station. Oh yeah, just another thing. Still, one train out on this ride for the third week in a row. Doesn't need it though. Oh yeah, we're going all out. Row eight. And we're, we're going on this uh, tense part of the ride. I just got off the uh, Superman and after about uh, like a 10 minute delay because supposedly somebody was on their phone. I forget the operator was. And they finally got us out of there. And my freaking home grayed out on the uh, presso loop in the back seat. That is intense. But uh, if you go to the brake run right here, and I don't think you can see it, the fright press hearse is underneath it. Yeah, right there. The Max Force truck is right there, and the hearse is right there. Huh. So this park is pretty much dead. It's uh, park's gonna be closing in about four hours, and we're gonna try to get as much as we can to get done. But you know, so on to the next ride. Ooh, my first time watching this this year. The wonder is all these Six Legs employees right here. <laughs> Jokers, not open. Well, that's a bummer. Yeah, Marty goes Hanover is running. You can see right there. But uh, if somebody who works at the park, it's like, what happened to the signs they had hanging out? There were like the villains. Like they did it the first year, and then they just took it out and never put it back. So. Blocked off, so apparently it's just not open or what. But 
There's the Joker. You are officially five years old. There you go. All right, so we got more stuff showing up here at the uh, former Willow gig. I think it's called uh, Villain's Swings. Uh, yeah, the yeah more of the equipment is, are coming in. But yeah, it's got good progress. And there's the flash vertical velocity. Nothing's changed. Except that I think this is new. I don't remember this being colored last week, but they obviously did that. If, if I could see anything that was changed was that. So, but uh, yeah, ride's not even testing or anything like that. So hopefully they will soon and get this ride opened up. All right, somebody had pointed this out in the other videos, but Claim Jumpers now holds Aunt Martha's. So you can get your Aunt Martha's here. Fortunately, close. Goliath has no line. I'm gonna go on it. Wow, I can't believe I'm saying this. <laughs> Goliath's gonna have to wait another day. I was just about to go up those steps right there, and the ride went down. So as of right now, the ride's down from uh, for some technical reason. Revolution still wrapped up. Still wrapped up. Oh, well, let's give uh, Beagle Blue a try again. Hopefully, the lighting too long. Looks like a station wait. Ain't nobody on the stairs. That's good. Oh, Glass back to testing. Might jump back on it after I get off this ride. We'll see. Definitely getting my steps on and getting to this ride. Definitely getting my steps. Alright, just got off the American Eagle Blue. And a couple things that I gotta bring up to your attention is the very noticeable thing when you're riding this ride is once you get off the lift around here, it slows so slow. It goes so slow, like it crawls. You think it's gonna break down. Watch. Well, it didn't crawl there. Huh. Well, it didn't do it that time. It didn't look like it, but literally we just barely just was going so slow. Like you, how you at the top of the hill, like it will stall. And then before you go over, it did that like three quarters of the way up. I thought it was like, I was gonna break down or something like that. It was going so slow. And then it just, it just crushed right over the hill. And then as soon as the chains, uh, the dog chain let go and there you go. But it's uh, red train is over there. They are running two trains, so that's good, even in slow times like this. But uh, it's still, my opinion, if it's not going backwards, it is the weakest part of the ride. It's definitely not as good as red. It's definitely vibration-y, but it's not rickety, I'll tell you that. So, but on to, probably go back to Goliath, but uh, yeah, hurry up. There's storms brewing up there. All right, we have to go back on Goliath, but the line's down to the stairs with one train, so time's the, of the essence here with the storms coming, so I'm gonna go jump on. Next flight. Ooh, we probably got a good hour, and these, storm, these clouds are gonna get dark. And that's gonna start raining, so after this ride, we're gonna have to make a book it to Raging Bull. And that's it. Okay. Alright, just got an X light. Good ride, but I just got a notification that there's a lightning strike within 14 miles of my location. So if that's not good, might not even get out and bowl. We might have to just get out of here soon. Let's get out and bowl quickly. I keep getting notifications every minute about lightning strike. Five miles, four miles, now three miles. I'm like, ooh. Hopefully they don't shut it down by the time I get on it. 
I'll be damned. We're on one train. That ah, sucks. One train. on the ride about two train wait uh so i'm good probably for the day uh still hey row seventh row hey it's still just as good as the eighth row just uh but the skies are yeah starting to look ominous right here so it's um it's coming all right maybe my last ride will be viper so just like the other rides station wait Hey, no bite in the station. <laughs> Only a few people. Alright, it's got on Viper. And it's starting to drip a little bit. Uh, it's actually, the train was actually running a little aggressively on the corners, but it's still kind of kind of tame. So. It's getting better, it's getting better, but uh, it's starting to drip a little bit. You see there's water on the, so hopefully uh, they don't shut it down anytime soon, but we're gonna keep going. Wizards down because they cannot run in the rain and it's coming out even harder. It's just rain though. The trail, keep the shelter. So we're getting out of here. It's raining. It's just rain at the moment, but it ain't storming, but it is just pound it's coming cold. down. Oh and it's gosh. cold rain. Whew. So get on. Quite a few rides for like what it was. But you can see the wind. Ooh, it's, blowing. it's blowing. So it's whipping. Yeah, it's whipping. So met some people at uh, uh, Viper. Uh, and at Biggie Z Blooms. And Biggie Z Blooms. Yep. Saw some fans. You know, nice to meet you guys. And uh, well, we'll try to come back next week. Maybe St. Louis, not sure. Food wise, there's a lot of restaurants. Oh, God, the turkey leg. Let's, let's talk oh my about gosh, that. That one's gonna kill us. Yeah, let's talk about that turkey leg for a minute. That turkey leg? Let's try. No. Yeah. If it wasn't for the barbecue sauce, it would be bad. Oh, my God. So, we're gonna get out of here. So, we'll talk to you guys later. And my finger was in the camera. So, good day. It's raining, as you see. So, all right, check out the channel, and we're gonna still come out with the uh, off-ride POVs, or not POVs, but off-ride footages of some of the rides. So, still working on it. I gotta get all the clips. So, we'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.